Jingle bells, jingle bells. The Christmas season officially arrived in Clinton County this weekend. Frankfurt Main Street organized a series of events Saturday evening that kicked off local festivities. About 50 kids participated in a hunt for Prancer's reindeer bell that went missing on the Clinton County Courthouse Square. Santa Claus shaped chocolates were hidden across the lawn and around the building, as were 10 special reindeer bells. The 10th and largest bell was extra special. It came with a cash reward won by three-year-old Arden Seifert of Arlington, Tennessee. Arden is the great niece of Frankfurt City Councilwoman Wanda Mitchell, and she came to town with her parents and brother for the Thanksgiving weekend. I saw that you just got the bell. Can you tell me where you found it? From the pole. From the pole? The silver one? Very cool. Maybe you could uh, show me what's in your envelope there. Money. <laughs> How much money? Arden said she wants to use her $100 reward to buy a puppy. Main Street Director Kim Stevens said Saturday's events provided a way to launch Christmas festivities a full week early. Santa does not come until the Christmas parade, but we wanted to light the tree earlier, and our book was The Polar Express, was our story. And so we just decided that, uh, that you know, we had to figure out a way to get the kids down here ahead of time for, the, for them to hunt for the bell. After all the candy and bells were recovered, the kids gathered around Elaine Walden, who read to them from the Polar Express. Walden said she agreed to story time on one condition, that she be given lots of hugs. Frankfurt Mayor Chris McBarnes led the families gathered in a few Christmas carols before he fired up the multicolored lights on a large tree on the courthouse lawn. One! All in all, Stevens said, planning the event was well worth the work. I'm extremely pleased. I think it went really well for our first event like this, and um, I think it's probably going to become a tradition, it sounds like. For a full story, pick up a copy of Monday's edition of The Times. In it, you'll also find a story on The Trading Post, a new flea market consignment shop on Rossville Avenue in Frankfurt. Also, Monday's edition includes a Your Neighbor feature story about weekend roller skating instructor Jason Coleman. For the Times newspaper in Frankfort, Indiana, I'm Stephen Porter. Thanks for watching.